Growing up, you may have had your fair share of odd jobs that you did in order to earn some extra money. However, those odd jobs can't be anywhere as unusual as the ones coming up. On top of being highly unusual, the following jobs are also highly rewarding, with most of them having five to six figure salaries. Here are the top 20 unusual jobs that pay really well. Amazing. Number 20, Professional TV Watcher Believe it or not, people get paid by simply watching TV shows. The job is simple. You watch a TV show, give it a proper tag and category, and then rate it. Professional TV watchers can earn around several hundred dollars per week. When late night talk show host Jimmy Kimmel hired TV watchers, he paid them $500 to $600 per week. To become a professional TV watcher, you must display objectiveness as well as having extensive knowledge about TV shows. If you're a couch potato looking to earn some money, then look out for these jobs. Number 19. Food Stylist and Photographer People with a passion for food often find themselves becoming chefs. If becoming a chef isn't your calling, then you might want to try your hand at becoming a food stylist. Their job is simple. Make the food look as tasty as possible. They're also in charge of taking equally appealing photos of their creations, allowing their clients to reach out to a broader audience. Food stylists can earn an average of $33,000 per year, while established food stylists can earn up to $850 a day. Instagram foodies will surely love to take a shot trying to land this job. Number 18 professional snuggler. Once considered a niche job, professional snuggling has quickly become a booming business. To become a snuggle buddy, a candidate must meet two core requirements. One, they must be an empathic and caring person. And two, they must not mind sharing their personal space with a total stranger. Don't worry though, companies that hire professional snugglers often let their employees decide who to snuggle with, as well as maintaining a strict no sexual activities policy. If you don't mind sharing a rather intimate experience with a stranger, becoming a professional snuggler isn't that bad of an idea. Number 17. Video Game Tester Video game testers earn decent pay from doing what they love the most, playing video games. With an average salary range of up to $36,000 annually, it's quickly becoming a lucrative job for gaming aficionados. Of course, becoming a video game tester is not all play and no work, as they're required to do things you would do in a normal office setting. It's just that the work is mostly gaming related. So be wary when applying for this position, as this job is mostly suited for people who have an undying passion for video games. Either that, or become a gaming YouTuber and potentially earn millions, like Vanoss Gaming does. Number 16. Paper Towel Sniffer Yes, this is an actual job, and it pays well too. The job description is basically just that. You smell paper towels. Tons of it. You see, these paper towel companies want their paper towels to be purely odorless. So they hire people who have a good sense of smell to sniff for them and see if their products are truly odorless. That's the same reason NASA hires a sniffer to smell everything that goes into space. The salary for a paper towel sniffer? Around $52,000 annually. And that's only for smelling paper towels. What about smelling farts? That's coming up later in the video. Number 15. Face Feeler Looking for a job that has a literal hands-on approach? Then look no further than this job. The premise of becoming a face feeler is simple. They feel their target consumers' faces in order to help companies which manufacture facial care products. Face feelers must be able to determine even the smallest details from their target consumers, which is why they're required to pass a tactile sensitivity test to become a full-fledged face feeler. A professional face feeler can earn around $10 to $25 an hour, depending on their expertise. With that salary range, it's best not to take this job at face value. Number 14. Body Part Model Essentially, they're models, but they only model a specific part of their body, their hands, their feet, or something else. These models are hired because they possess the perfect body parts to suit their clients' needs. And just like regular models, they're paid handsomely. A modeling gig can give them up to $5,000 per day with the possibility of earning $75,000 annually. If you think you have the perfect body parts that companies can use to highlight their products, apply to become a body part model. This job might serve as your gateway to the modeling industry. Number 13, Worm Picker. Worm pickers basically do as their job title implies. They pick up worms, collect them inside a box, and deliver them to people selling worms as fish bait. They're also in charge of keeping them alive while they make the delivery feeding them, and replacing the soil they thrive on whenever needed. Salary? You can earn around $13 per hour, working 40 hours per week, 
earning you around $27,000 plus health and medical benefits annually. If you don't mind getting dirty, this job is the right one for you. Number 12, Pearl Divers. Pearl divers do essentially the same as worm pickers, except this time, they look for pearls in potentially dangerous waters. Compared to other jobs mentioned, becoming a pearl diver requires education and diving expertise. Knowledge about pearls and oysters is a big plus for this job as well. Pearl divers are well compensated, earning up to $1,200 per day, with experienced divers capable of earning six figures a year. It's definitely a great career choice for underwater enthusiasts looking to earn from their hobbies. Number 11. Gross Stunts Tester Often seen in reality shows, gross stunts will make just about anyone, well, gross out. Not gross stunts testers, however, as this is their job. They're tasked to take on these stunts before the contestants do to determine if they're really safe. Not really a job you would want, especially since you're taking a bullet meant for the contestants. On the plus side, however, this job pays $800 daily. It also comes with numerous medical benefits, considering the risk involved. It better come with a number of sick leaves too, because you'll definitely need them. Number 10. Armpit Sniffer Armpit sniffers are paid to do exactly what their job titles imply, smell the armpits of various people. Stuck in a room filled with sweaty men and women, you will need to sniff their armpits one by one. Once you're done, you'll need to apply deodorant and sniff them once more to see if it's truly effective. If you're more than willing to smell more than 60 armpits in an hour, you'd be on your way to pocketing up to $52,000 per year. Think you have the stomach for this job? Number 9. Embalmer a grotesque yet honorable job, embalmers take it upon themselves to make their clients, the deceased, look presentable at their funerals. They wash their bodies, apply preserving agents to prevent deterioration, and use makeup to restore their appearance. It's a challenging job, but it is highly rewarding as an embalmer can earn an average annual salary of $45,000, with experienced embalmers earning up to $64,000 annually. Should you choose to be an embalmer, always remember one thing. Treat your clients, both the dead and the living, with utmost respect. Number 8. Fart Smeller While China has no shortage of highly rewarding jobs, it also has no shortage of careers that can be considered unusual, like being a professional fart smeller. According to the Chinese, smelling these expelled gases can help in determining ailments plaguing the patient. These professional fart smellers are trained to smell different types of farts allowing them to diagnose properly. Seems like a stinky job, but with an annual salary of $50,000, it's not really that bad of a deal. Maybe you know someone who should get tested. Share this video with them to let them know. Just pray that your fart smeller of choice doesn't faint if they're notoriously smelly. Number 7. Crime Scene Cleaner Cleaning up grisly and gruesome crime scenes? doesn't really fit the dream job category, right? But what if this job pays you big money to the sum of around 80,000 a year? Becoming a crime scene cleaner doesn't simply involve scrubbing away the blood and removing corpses. You need to properly clean and disinfect the area to prevent contamination and the spread of diseases. Cleaners are also required to restore the crime scene to how it originally looked, as if a crime never occurred there. It's a really tough job, but somebody's got to do it. Number six, fortune cookie riders. Ever wonder who writes those fortunes you see in fortune cookies? Well, they're done mostly by freelance writers. But unlike other writers, they need to write their pieces bite-sized, kind of like those fortune cookies. These writers need to be witty and creative to come up with somewhat philosophical phrases and sentences. So what's the salary for this type of job? They can earn around $12 to $50 per project. The fortunate ones, however, can earn up to $75,000 annually. If you're the creative type of writer, you might as well try your hand on becoming one. Who knows? It might just earn you a fortune. Number 5. Bingo Manager If you're thinking that this job would be as easy as your local bingo happenings, you might want to think twice about taking this job. The role of a bingo manager is basically an all-around one. Manage bingo activities personally, approve and award prizes to the winners, secure forms and licenses to adhere to the local government's rules and regulations on gambling, and many more. If you think you can handle all these, you will be well compensated with an average salary of $60,000, depending on the location of your business. So take a shot. This job might just earn you your jackpot. Number 4. Submarine Chef Chefs are amongst the highest paid people in the world. Doubly so if they're a submarine chef, as you can earn up to $200,000 per year plus allowances, if you're willing to live under the sea for a few months. 
Submarine chefs do what chefs normally do, provide nutritious and delicious meals to the crew three times a day, and sometimes fill in the occasional midnight snack requests. Besides that, they're free to do anything as long as they adhere to the officer's rules. Not like that they'd be able to do other things inside a submarine. Number three, pet food taster. Crazy as it may be, this kind of job exists. The goal of pet food tasters is to ensure that pets, usually cats and dogs, get the best meals possible. They don't eat pet food per se, rather they just chew and check its texture, allowing them to see if it's fit for pet consumption. Basically, these pet food tasters help you deal with those finicky pets. A pet food taster's salary ranges from $40,000 to $120,000 per year. People surely won't call you crazy now with that kind of salary. Number two, line stander. Tired of waiting in lines to buy that new phone? Hire a line stander to stand in line for you. Minutes, hours, or even days, they will stay in line and won't budge. A professional line stander can earn up to $1,000 per week, charging their clients around $25 for the first hour and $10 every succeeding half hour. So if you have extra time and you want to earn a quick buck, then this is the right job for you. Number one, nude model. Being naked in front of people, nude models serve as an outlet for modern artists to express their inner creativity. While it may seem embarrassing to pose naked for other people, it comes with many strict guidelines that should be followed by both the model and the clients, with the best interests of the model being prioritized over anything else. Nude model salary are usually billed hourly, with the minimum being 20 bucks an hour. They can earn an average of $30,000 upwards annually. Becoming a nude model isn't easy, but for those who aren't afraid to bear it all, then this job definitely fits the bill. Would you want to apply for one of these odd yet high paying jobs? Let me know in the comments section down below. Thanks for watching.